So I run the city of Green Bay, which is pretty much what I do. Like those of you who draw, those of you who paint, my art is the city. And I want to make the city like really beautiful. I want to make it interactive. I want to make it exciting. And that's what I work on. And we have a thousand people who work in the city of Green Bay. And what I look for when we hire people, and there's not a good test yet for this, is to find out if they're creative. Because creative is what brings the new ideas. Creative people are sought after. And the way you become creative is to think outside the box, as they say. It's to expand beyond what um, like a task and think more about it as a piece of art. It's to interact, even the Boys and Girls Club. When I was here, which was a long time ago, we didn't have creative arts. We didn't have the video, conf the, the videos that you can do, the music, all the photography. Um, we kind of just played billiards, pool, uh, and ping pong, which was fun, it was great. But they, they looked at that and they said, look, and, and, and uh, Mr. Alex and of course Mr. Bemberg have really tried to get more creative things here because that makes you think broader, it makes you think bigger, and then it's going to help the economy here in Green Bay. It's also going to help you find really, really good jobs. The people who spend a little time being creative and engaging with the arts and engaging with photography and engaging with um, things besides a task are the people that are really being sought after for jobs. So I hope you all come and work for us someday. Um, I, I hope one of you, if not more than one of you, become the mayor of Green Bay because we want creative people to think of new ideas and how to be a more awesome city and how to work with all, all the people in our community. So to make that official, what I do as the mayor is I write a proclamation. And a proclamation is, it, right, proclamation, proclaiming. And it's not just me as your mayor saying this is important. This is a document that goes into the city archives. Uh, and that means it's, uh, we, we, we not only uh, document this as a piece of history, but when I write a proclamation, it's speaking not just on behalf of me, but on all the 104,000 people that live here. So that's kind of the authority the mayor has to proclaim something. And I, I only proclaim things that are really uh, important and that are gonna help Green Bay grow and, and help Green Bay prosper and help the youth in our community and help the businesses in our community. So I'm gonna read this proclamation and then I'm going to sign it and then it becomes like this official document. This proclamation that we're celebrating today, it reads, whereas, and whereas means because, but we like to use whereas. Whereas Green Bay recognizes that investments in creative economy develop, development and the Boys and Girls Club Youth Arts Initiative are important to the health and vibrancy of the community and its future. Now listen up. Whereas students who study art are four times more likely to be recognized for academic achievement. So you study art four times better grades and three times more likely to be awarded for school attendance. So kids that study the arts and that are creative have a better attendance in school. And whereas researchers find that sustained learning in music and theater correlates strongly with higher achievement in both math and reading. So if you study the arts, like we're doing here, and creative things, photography, music, that you do much better in both math and reading. And whereas new brain research shows that not only does music improve skills in math and reading, but it promotes creativity, social development, personality adjustment, and self-worth. So what that means is kids who like study the arts have better personalities, they're more social, more fun to get along with, and they feel better about themselves. And that's what this is all about. And whereas Green Bay appreciates that the creative economy, development, and community culture engagement are directly related to economic vitality, education for the 21st century, and engaging residents and communities' future and success. And whereas Green Bay celebrates many impressive creative economy activities, projects, and initiatives, such as education programs, like here at the Boys and Girls Club, revitalization initiatives and civic engagement projects. 
happening in the communities across the state during Creative Economy Week. And whereas Green Bay recognizes that investment in the creative economy is critical for Green Bay's success. So now therefore I, James J. Schmidt, the mayor of the city of Green Bay, do hereby proclaim the week of April 24th to the 30th, 2016 as Creative Economy Week in the city of Green Bay to celebrate and promote the arts, creativity, vitality for our community and throughout the state. And that's dated today, the 22nd of April, and signed by James J. Schmidt. Yay! Yeah. 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 All right, take a shake hands. Take a shake hands. Congratulations, artist.